was the reaction like uh, post game with, with Popeye getting his first win as a head coach? What was it like in the locker room? Oh, we, we were crazy on yeah. him. Yeah, we throw her like water. We were, but we were very happy for him because we we got a lot of injured player. Now the our head coach is with COVID, assistant coach with COVID. So somehow we gotta hide that with more be more un together, be together as a team, uh, playing as hard as possible. And I think after the game, we try to show our love to Papai. He's a big part of this victory. Knowing how depleted you guys were, how many guys are in the protocol, coaches, players, does that, I know you play hard all the time, but did you, does, is that in your mind, like, I got to play even harder, I got to turn it up? Yeah, we, we have to. Uh, if we don't do that, we, we, we're we going to lose games. So. Uh, we like I said, we gotta like hide the injuries and COVID things uh, with more playing harder. No, one hundred percent, just two hundred percent. Even more smart, be focused in every play, play, play every offense as a final, you know, as playoff mentality. And I think we did that. Uh, we play with a lot of pace, with a lot of hustle. We we weren't. Uh, worry about in offense because I think we play great defense and play great defense. Great defense make you be aggressive on in, in offense. You know, we we we've been very uh, we shared the ball very well. So I think what, what that was one of the key. Twenty-two points for you, which I believe is a career high for you, and then twelve assists. Just what, what, talk about your game, why you played so well, what was going well for you out there. Uh, Studies for you guys. <laughs> Uh, I just try to don't look that, but I I can say I feel with a lot of I felt with a lot of confidence. I just try to don't be try to don't be uh, crazy with the ball. Just try to be smart, make the right decision. We have Joe. Uh, after that, we can everything good can happen, you know. So we we trust on his game and we create our game fr from him. So just I just try to play. With a lot of hustle, energy in defense, try to be aggressive uh, in the offense. I don't know, just try to be myself. After the, the Rockets got off to a really good start in the first quarter, you guys kind of settled down, caught them, and obviously had the big second quarter. What uh, what changed? What, what did you guys do differently to get that? We, pl we play harder yeah, on defense. We we were not worried about the offense. I think, like I said, we, if we play with energy on defense, be aggressive on defense uh, and smart. Uh, the, the the offense, the plays, uh, is going to be by itself, you know. So we we, we did that. Uh, we changed our mentality and play with more hustle. Um, were you more pleased with your – he just spoke to the offense, 22 points, 12 assists. Uh, Popeye told us you won defense player of the game, eight deflections and five steals. What what are you more proud of? What are you more pleased with? Different, I think different for sure. Uh, I like to win my game of my confidence on the game from the difference. I I, I don't want to be worried about the offense. Obviously, in this league, you gotta score for be more aggressive. You know, if we, it's, it's very important to score in this league. But I just try to create my game from the difference. Try to uh, be focus smart a lot of hustle don't make mistake mistake uh, in the defense so i think i did that during the game i know you focus on the defense but can you walk us through the, the double behind the back uh kevin porter you got him and then you throw behind the back pass to uh ag uh it was funny uh it was fine it was funny 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 oh, okay. <laughs> it was great uh I think he he the different touched the ball just a little bit, uh, but I like I just start like really bad in that kind of spot because I turned the the ball over like a couple of times before, so I, I start thinking okay I gotta start like slow you know and that happened I don't know I didn't think about it I just uh, try to be aggressive touch the paint the paint and I don't know came by itself. <laughs> do, do those kinds of plays and you have so many of them? Do you? Is it, is it conscious decisions to behind the back or through the legs? Or, I mean, or, or, is it, or are things just happening and you're just doing it? The pass between the legs is just try to take advantage of my size because every big man is like showing so hard and big. It's maybe bigger than me. So with legs open, it's, I think it's the most, it's harder to pass that. So I don't try to do that at the beginning of the game. 
But if I see that, I just try to throw it, you know? Uh, it's very important how uh, the big man screen. Uh, and I think we are doing a, a great job on that. But I just try to enjoy every time I got the ball, uh, involve every, every, my teammates involved in the game, and I enjoy a lot of that. Hola Facu, feliz año nuevo, felicitaciones por la victoria y por tu gran performance. Eh, ¿Por dónde empezar? Primero que nada, récord personal en puntos, segundo doble doble de tu carrera en la NBA. ¿Cómo te hace sentir eso? ¿Y cuán especial es para ustedes esta victoria teniendo en cuenta la cantidad de baja por los protocolos, no? Más allá de las lesiones. Eh, bueno, eh, las estadísticas se las dejo a ustedes, los periodistas que saben hacer mejores cosas. Eh, intento no que influya eso en mi juego. Eh, como decías antes en, en inglés, eh, intento ganar mi confianza del juego de la defensa, contagiar a mis compañeros, tal energía. Eh, y creo que me sentí muy bien en ese aspecto del juego. Eh, y bueno, con todas las lesiones que tenemos y todos los protocolos de COVID, eh, de los jugadores, de asistentes, de entrenador. Eh, tenemos que disimular esas bajas con más intensidad, eh, más concentración, jugando un buen básquet, creo que es importante, no solamente, no solamente ganas partidos con actitud, intensidad y pelea, sino también con, con buen básquet y creo que lo hicimos muy bien, eh, y quiera o no, eso te da una motivación extra, ¿no? cuando no tenés casi más de la mitad de la plantilla y el cuerpo técnico eh, en los partidos, eh, creo que es una motivación para jugar por ellos, eh, por lo menos, para jugar por ellos y para intentar conseguir la victoria que es muy importante para nosotros Oh, yes Thank you 